Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a happy Sunday. i um, back here today with um, my Play by Sephora box. Uh, looking forward to showing you guys what I got this month. So I'm going to jump right in. So excited when this comes down. This is my third box. So let me show you. It comes with a little booklet. And of course, everything. I see some goodies already that. I'm really really excited about so I'm going to just kind of go um, in order of the book just because it's like little fun facts and cool tips and I just kind of want to keep that in order for you so the first thing here and I'm super excited about this because I've never tried it and I love primers so this is a makeup forever um, what is it skin equalizing primer so it's a little sample Um, but I mean it's a good size you know just to like try the product out and see if I like it or not um, so it says here um, this hydrating primer helps makeup last longer while the targeted formula balances skin's texture resulting in a smoother more even look um, and then the little tip here is mix a little of this primer into your foundation it creates a sheer coverage that is perfect for that kind of casual day look so okay so yeah um, little sample but I'll probably get um, you know a handful of uses out of that so that's pretty cool I'm excited about that so the next thing we have is okay that's the lippy so it's a bite beauty high pigment lip pencil and the color is rhubarb so let me take it out of the box Oh, I really like this color. This is a beautiful color. That I'll show you. It's a nice, you know, deep red color, which I like. And, you know, I don't know why I'm bothering swatching this because my lighting's pretty horrible, but it's a really pretty color. And that goes on super, super creamy. So I'm really excited about that one. And let's just see what it says. Um, getting the perfect application of concentrated modern color is simple with this creamy, antioxidant rich lip pencil. Okay, so little facts here. Um, if you're going to be in New York City, stop by Bite Beauty's Lip Lab in Soho to get the ultimate experience in lip color and create your own custom shade. So that's actually pretty cool. Wow, you can go in and make your own shade. In a lip, that's so cool. I love that. Um, and then a how-to tip. Put down that lip liner to get a perfect finish. Just swipe on a bit of primer and apply this pencil as you would a lipstick. That's cool. I've never put a primer on my lips before, but I know I, I mean, I've seen videos where people have done that. Um, so cool. And let me see. Um, another fun fact is all Bite Beauty pencils are edgy and edible. Edible. <laughs> Each one is made with organic fruit butters, manuka honey, and antioxidants like resveratrol. So, wow, that's pretty cool. Okay, so that's that. I'm sorry if I'm rambling a little bit here, but I want to just kind of share all these like little tips and facts with you. So the next item is a lip gloss from Buxom Full On Lip Cream. It's the box. Let me take it out. The color is Dolly. Looks like a pink pinky color. Oh, these boxes are hard to open sometimes. Okay. So, okay, that's like a really nice size. That's a really cool size. Let me, that's a nice pink color. Cool. All right, so let's see what it says about this one. Um, get the look of fuller lips with this creamy glass smooth plumping gloss and a universally flattering shimmer free pink shade oh so it's a plumping gloss so that's cool I have such thin lips so I need to try something like that that maybe that will help me we'll see um, and little tip here um, windy day outside keep your hair from sticking to your lips by rubbing an ice cube over this gloss before going out interesting and that makes sense but like, I, who would ever think to do that? I don't know. 
maybe a lot of people. I would never think to do that. That's cool. Okay, so the next thing we have here is an eyeliner. It's just a mini eyeliner, and I don't know if you can get the color here. It's blue. So this is a Sephora eyeliner, and it says silky smooth texture, long-lasting formula, and a hint of shimmer make this waterproof liner so much more than a pop of vibrant color. Okay, so it says do something playful and unexpected by applying this liner on your waterline. So maybe I'll try that because I don't wear, I don't wear blue liner. I've never, I haven't worn blue liner since the 80s. So, um, yeah, but you know, I'm starting to see more and more people actually wear the blue liner and it looks really good on them. Um, so I might give this a shot in my waterline just to kind of, you know, see how it looks. It has a little, um. I'm not going to open it because it's so small and it has one of these little tabby things and my fingers are no good today. Okay, so we got two more products. The next one, and oh my goodness, I am super, super excited about this because I love, I love oils and I have been wanting to try this oil, but it's a little, you know, it's pretty expensive. So um, let me just show you. It's the Josie Moran. Um, pure 100% pure argan oil so I am so happy about this because I have wanted to order this from Sephora so many times and it's just so expensive so I'm so happy that I'm getting to try a sample of it you know just to see if I like it it comes in a little bottle like that with the dropper and let me just read what it says here this pure organic argan oil absorbs quickly and goes on light, making it one of nature's best multitaskers for restoring balance and nourishing all skin types. Like I said, I love oil, so um, I already do use a lot of oils on my face. And um, Yeah, so next thing, um, tip. If your waterproof eye makeup won't come off, try removing it with a swipe of argan oil, which we all know that um, oil cleansers are the best, at least in my opinion. I love oil cleansers to take off makeup, so that's cool. And then the last tip here, um, get all-in-one coverage and glow. Just mix a few drops of argan oil into your foundation. So I already do that with my, um, I have my rose, um, rose hip seed oil, and I already do that. I mix it in with my um, moisturizer. I, I switch between rose hip seed oil and grape seed oil. Um, they just work well with my skin. But I do put the, a drop in my moisturizer and I'll put it also a drop in my foundation or like BB cream or whatever I'm using on whatever day. So um, I do follow that already. So the last thing here we have is a Stella McCartney sample perfume. And it's Stella. Let me see if I can open this up. Okay, so of course it's just a little, you know, little sample thing. I'm going to spray this and okay. Okay, so that's really nice actually. That smells really pretty. Let me see what it says here. Feminine and sophisticated, this floral fragrance beautifully blends notes of rose and rich amber. And I do smell that the first thing I smelt was the rose and now I'm starting to smell the amber so yeah that's really nice that must be the second note that's really pretty okay so Stella McCartney does not use any animal or animal derived ingredients in any of her clothing accessories or fragrances so that's pretty cool and a fun fact is uh, the scent of roses works like an antidepressant and encourages happiness so give yourself a little spray whenever you need to pick me up Okay, so that's a cool little fun fact because I didn't know about that, and cool. All right, guys, so that's it. There were six items in my box this, this month. I am super happy with all of these things. These are all things that, again, I have not tried. I've seen on Sephora many, many times. I've wanted to purchase, and, um, you know, a lot of these things are just really expensive. So I'm going to go ahead and read you the prices here for, you know, if you were to buy in store, like a small, uh, full size. Um, the Makeup Forever Primer goes for $36. The Bite uh, Lip Pencil goes for $24. The Buxom Lip Plumper goes for $19. Um, the Sephora Eyeliner goes for $10. Um, the Josie Moran Argan Oil 
goes for $48 for a small bottle. So, oy. So I'm so happy I got the sample to try. Um, and then the Stella perfume for a small bottle is $50. So in total, um, if I were to buy a small bottle of each of these products, you know, in Sephora, it would cost me approximately $187. And instead, I'm trying them all for $10. So I think that is well worth it. Super happy. I cannot recommend this monthly subscri subscription box highly enough. Um, I've been, there's only been three boxes, but I have been super, super impressed and happy with all three of them so far. So, um, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. That's it for my video. Again, I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday. And, um, Please like and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, bye!